Right then, this is a walk around video, and this is for my own personal truck actually. Um, this is a Toyota Hilux, a 3 litre Invincible diesel. Um, as you can see here, finished with the rear canopy. It's got roof bars, um, and obviously the ones at the front there as well. An absolutely beautiful truck, this one. It really, really is. It's done 99,000 miles. And obviously you can see here, finished in black with a full grey leather interior. Uh, truck is in absolutely brilliant condition. Uh, it's not to say it hasn't got the odd light mark, because of course it has. But what it is, unlike so many, is one that's hardly ever been used for sort of commercial use of any note. So go around the truck for you. Really clean on the front end. Bonnet, exceptionally clean. There's literally hardly anything of any note on there at all little sprays which will just probably just polish straight off front above the uh, fog light there but of no note at all flanks again for a truck of this size in really lovely condition paintwork all looks really original as well full set of Goodyear Wrangler tires all round on the vehicle um, front near side alloy there absolutely unmarked panel work is just really really clean with just the odd very light mark one tiny little dimple dent just see it there but it's a minuscule and then coming around the back again really really clean sorry forgot the wheel near side rear absolutely unmarked again no corrosion there at all and then coming to the back of the truck really good angle for it very handsome looking vehicle you got the high level rear spoiler on the back as well. Rear parking sensors, tow bar. Again, tailgate all looks really good. There's no obvious nasty indentations on there at all. And then off side of the vehicle, again, in really, really lovely condition. Off side rear alloy, again, completely unmarked. And remaining panel work again, really nice. There was again another tiny little indentation. There it is. Yes, there. I can see. But I am being hypercritical, really, because it's very rare to see them like this. And then finally, offside front alloy, again completely unmarked. But it is a really, really handsome-looking beast, and there is no VAT on this truck at all. It's so coming into the back now. Obviously, they are cavernous in the back. Uh, obviously because you've got the glass panels on the side there, lots of natural light coming in, load liner fitted. I've also got a um, ply cover for this as well, just for the bottom part, which um, comes with the vehicle as well, which is why the load line has been kept so nicely. Now, if you think the exterior was nice, the interior is absolutely amazing. Again, for a truck, as I mentioned, the, the um, driving section coming after this, it's normally trucks are very heavily used this one i mean it really is an absolutely remarkable condition coming to the back again all very 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 clean foot well errors all the original mats all the tailored ones genuine sort of total ones there and the rear seat here looks almost factory fresh it is ridiculously clean Finally coming to the driver's side, again door card, absolutely beautiful. Footwell areas again, really clean. They've just been hoovered, they've not been washed or anything like that to make them look nice. It's exactly as they are. And driver's seat is again in incredible condition. Most of these on the Hiluxes, the bolsters go very heavily indeed. The only way you've really got is the tiniest little bit there. And that is pretty much the sum total of it. So inside now, engine's running through this section so the dashboard can be seen illuminated. Dashboard is in just beautiful condition. You see there's sat nav, which is again, lovely to see on this vehicle. All working exactly as it should. Climate control system or air conditioning system, lovely and cold as well. But it has been kept absolutely beautifully. And then come back here. Across the dashboard itself, you can see there 99,228 miles, and apart from a low fuel light on, there are no warning lights on the dashboard at all. Um, 
but as is often the case, videos cannot and will not do justice to the interior of this car, or truck in this case. Just to quickly show you, owner's manual packs and lock and unlock keys all here and present with the truck. Right then, this is a quick road test video, and this is for a Toyota Hilux. Uh, this is a 3 litre diesel and it's the Invincible Automatic model. The car's covered 99,222 miles. The reason we do these videos very simply is so that if anyone's looking at this car in an advert online, they get to see that very vehicle in operation, which we feel is really important because we know to our costs, unfortunately, just how frustrating it can be to go and see a car which can look very good in the description in the advert provided only to get there to find out it's got a fundamental issue which would probably have stopped you going to see it it's also done on these very quiet country roads close to our premises and this actually forms part of the road test route anyone goes on hopefully then it will be representative of what you'd feel yourself should you be offered to test drive in the vehicle as you hopefully know from the advert um, this is actually my own personal vehicle um, and as I said genuinely with a heavy heart that this one's going uh, I love this truck um, been wonderfully well looked after recently serviced and again a re fairly recent MOT as well uh, truck mechanically just can't fault it starts absolutely perfectly each and every time I've used it and settles to completely smooth even idle uh, there are no warning lights and there's never been any warning lights on the vehicle related to the engine or any other part of the vehicle or any, any other part of the engine as well I'll do the temperature gauge a little bit later because I try and do these videos from um, stone cold and it is a particularly chilly morning this morning um, so I'll pick up on that a little bit later in the video the engines I, I don't really see, need to say much about them apart from it's typical of the breed it's a really lovely diesel engine um, you know of its time definitely you know it's a it's a lugger, it, it's one that thrives on torque rather than sort of revving out, there's no point really. Um, but operates absolutely perfectly, pulls really strongly. I mean, I bought it for a mission, I've got a um, actually a relatively small caravan, um, but I needed something to tow that in the summer holidays uh, for me and the family. And I've always loved taking these sorts of things on uh, away on holiday with us because uh, it's just so so practical. But it's a it's a Fabulous. So you're going to stop there. Um, quick, you may. <laughs> um, but yeah, it's just it's it's perfect for this kind of operation. I mean, it just you don't even know the things on the back. Absolutely brilliant. You know, the engine starts to be sort of pulled down slightly, and then just kind of stays there. It, it rarely has to drop down a gear, but yeah, so it pulls like an absolute train automatic version um, again really strong boxes in these things uh, the obvious stuff to check for is making sure that obviously the gears select nice and smoothly as they, they should do and that when you engage drive from cold um, the, or even hot there shouldn't be any great delays or thunks and engagements and there's nothing at all um, absolutely spot on gear changes are really nice on the car uh, very smooth as you'd expect from any Toyota product um, so much so you can hardly feel them in all honesty, but there we are. Coming to the steering of the vehicle, feels really tight, solid, um, you know, <laughs> don't get me wrong, it's not a sports car, it very much feels, as I said, of its age, I love it actually, I've always loved these things. So they're not a truck to hustle around, but it's, as I said, the rack, everything feels really tight on the vehicle, um, it tracks dead straight. There's no vibrations uh, coming back to the steering wheel at this speed or any speed up to the legal limit. Clearly, I've done plenty of miles, so I'm so well versed in how it how it drives in that sense. Um, chassis of the vehicle, what I'm looking for, and the perfect point just coming up now. There, that horrible bump. Um, I'm just listening out for any sort of nasty sort of clonks or rattles coming from underneath the vehicle. But again, absolutely nothing. Just really, really tight and taut the whole thing. Just make sure no one's behind us, just 
give the brakes a bit of a shove, but they're, they're, I know they're solid anyway. I mean, they, 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 it's obviously been through the MOTs, everything like that, but they, they're certainly powerful in the way they operate. Coming to the interior, um, hopefully this is just a reminder of kind of what I said in the walkaround video. The problem with trucks, of course, is, as I said, it's, it's, they do tend to be used for quite heavy commercial use. Um, so even ones which have been actually very well looked after, possibly had seat covers on, you can't get away from the fact that, you know, dust and grime gets into all the little nooks and crannies over the years and they, they, they just look old, even as the carpets, you can clean them, but they never really look clean. Um, this truck is without doubt the cleanest truck we've ever had and we've had lots of them over the years. L200s, Navaras, other Hiluxes, Denvers, you name it. Um, it's just been kept absolutely, it's been kept like a car inside. I mean the interior is absolutely stunning in here. Um, the carpets, the seats look like something that's done a quarter of the miles. It's absolutely incredible. Also, as you'd expect from Toyota, just beautifully, beautifully made. Uh, no squeaks, no rattles, which can be really annoying. So actually just squeak and rumble away the whole time. But there's nothing in here. They're also quite quiet on the move. Um, you know, when you're tootling along, it's a, it's a, it's a lovely place to sit. Um, all of it's working absolutely perfectly. Sat nav option, you can see there, absolutely spot on. Um, CD player, just press the button, opens up for the CDs. Air conditioning, absolutely ice cold. Um, I had that gas as soon as I bought the uh, truck, and it's lovely and cold in the vehicle. Coming to the dashboard again, simple, easy, legible dials. Temperature gauge now running at just over third, which is exactly where it's meant to be on one of these vehicles as well, so all absolutely spot on. As I said at the start of the video, it's only brief, um, but it's literally just to show the vehicle in operation. As I said, this is my truck. Um, you know, it's going to be supplied with a warranty via our company, but say that you, it's been bought from me. I've been driving it. I'm hiding nothing. It just drives absolutely superbly. Um, as always, though, if you've got any questions about the vehicle, don't hesitate. Do give us a call.